So without further ado, our special guest is... Good morning to you. Welcome to our channel today, you guys. I hope your day's off to a great start. I just have to start off today's vlog by saying thank you so much. You guys are just amazing. We put out that video yesterday with me surprising Jared with a pregnancy test. It was the first pregnancy test I've ever bought, you guys, and so I was really excited to bring that home and show him. So if you haven't checked out that video, go check it out. But you guys were all so excited, which just makes it even more exciting for Jared and I. It makes us so happy that we can share this journey with all of you. So thank you so much. So my morning is off to a good start. I thought it'd be fun for today's video to kind of show you what my regular morning routine is. I try and keep to the same routine almost every morning. I do switch up a few things here and there, but it's almost nine o'clock now. So I've already been up for a couple hours. I'm almost ready to start work because as you know, I am working from home right now. But you guys, there's a few things I thought you might find interesting that I do every morning. It's just part of my routine. As you know, I am trying to get pregnant. So I have changed some of these things up a little bit to be a little more healthy and to get my body ready for that, hopefully. The first thing I do in the morning when I wake up, I usually wake up between 6 and 6.30. I used to wake up earlier and go to a gym to work out, but now that we're staying at home, that has changed. So I usually wake up around 6, 6.30. So the first thing that I usually do is I wake up and I go into our kitchen and we have this little electric kettle that's awesome. So I put some water in there, about 32 ounces of water, and I heat that up and then I add half a lemon to that. Now I do that because obviously you're supposed to drink a ton of water when trying to get pregnant and when you are pregnant. Just in everyday life in general, right? The more water you drink, the better it is for you. So I find that adding a little bit of lemon to that helps it's really just calming and relaxing in the morning. I drink that before I do my workout. While I'm drinking that, you guys, I usually try and I do something spiritually. So usually I'll like listen to a talk that I find inspiring or I read my scriptures, just something that really kind of starts my day off to a good positive start. After that, I always try and get in some sort of exercise. Lately, I have been doing yoga, which I'm really, really loving. I do something called 30 Days of Yoga with Adrian. It's on YouTube. It's totally free, and I am loving that. It's kind of crazy, but yoga is really tricky. I love her program, though, because it kind of eases you into it. It works your way up with levels. I feel like I'm getting stronger and using different muscles than I have previously, like with a cardio workout. But I kind of switched it up. Today I did do some yoga, which was relaxing. It was about 40 minutes. And then after that, jump in the shower really quick. I threw on some makeup. I do want to maybe share my makeup routine with you guys and a skincare routine. I get quite a few messages on that. So let me know if you would like to see that. And I'll probably do that here in the coming weeks. But after that, I'm kind of to this point where my little finners comes and he wants some love. Now I'm ready to make some breakfast. So I'm going to show you guys what I'm making today. I love breakfast but usually I don't love a big heavy breakfast most mornings usually we'll save that for like Saturday or a Sunday so typically I'll make like a green smoothie I am out of spinach though right now I can't make one of those those are one of my go-to things I love eggs a lot I'll make like oats with fresh strawberries or blueberries but today I'm gonna make some eggs and some avocado toast with trying to get pregnant I try and eat as healthy as I can right now I definitely still do have my treats things like that but I am trying to put as much nutrients into my body as I can to be as healthy as I can so I can hopefully grow up a little baby. So I'm ready to get breakfast started so I'll show you what I do.
Okay, so let me show you what I have so far. I have some of my favorite bread. This is a whole grain sprouted wheat bread. I love this kind of bread because of the little seeds and grains. I just love some crunch to my bread. Sometimes I toast this, sometimes I just leave it plain. Today I'm leaving it plain for dinner night. So I just smash up my avocado that you guys saw. I cut up a tomato and then I have my other half of my lemon from this morning. So I'm gonna use this as well. And then basically I just put the tomato here put that on there like that and Jared and I love tomatoes with avocado if you don't love this you can totally just keep it plain use whatever you like sometimes I'll put like cilantro on here or cheese but today I'm just doing the tomato and avocado and then I just put some pepper and salt on here and then I love this Trader Joe's chili lime seasoning a lot of the time I'll put this on here this is great on eggs too like scrambled eggs I use this for a ton of different things but it gives it a lot of flavor. And then I just squeeze on the lemon. And as usual, my little sous chef's right here, right by me, hoping something's gonna fall, huh, buddy? <laughs> yeah, you just... <laughs> He needs a bath today for sure, you guys. So that's on the list. So avocado toast is done. Now I'm gonna fry up two eggs for Darren and I. Sometimes I'll put the eggs right on the toast and kind of make the center runny, which is really yummy. But today I think we're just gonna have eggs on the side. All right guys, I got my eggs cooking. I'm curious, how do you guys like your eggs cooked? Do you like them scrambled, fried, poached? I feel like there's so many ways to do your eggs. I love them always, so I like to switch it up. Sometimes I'll do like scrambled eggs with sauteed veggies in there. Eggs obviously have a lot of protein and things like that, so I feel like it's a healthy, good breakfast and it's not too heavy. So it's definitely one of our go-to breakfasts. So let me show you, I put the lid on mine for about the last minute without flipping them. So you can see, so it's just starting to cook the top of them. These are about done. I feel like with the lid on, it steams it a little bit. So as you can tell, that's still, I kind of cut it open, that's still runny. And then the bottom gets nice and crispy as well. So these are just about done. So I'm gonna turn off the heat. Oh, yummy. Just then. Oh, shoot. Try it again. Oh! <laughs> no, Bailey. Dang it! Oh my gosh. I just dropped our egg. Well, guys, that was a breakfast fail. But you know what? That's real life. Sometimes that happens. So I'm gonna cook up one more egg, and then we are gonna eat breakfast, and then I gotta get started with work. So guys, I know this is the first time you're seeing me in the vlog. I've just been hanging out while well, Britt's been working. I've been sleeping. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm totally kidding. She's right here, actually. She's been editing. <laughs> we are just out here enjoying the nice weather, you guys. And I got a package in the mail this evening, and I could not wait to try it on. With being quarantined, you guys, I got a little bored the other day, and I got onto Target's website, and I saw their new cute spring dresses that just came out, and I couldn't help myself, so I ordered this one, and I am in love with it. So I wanted to show it to you guys, so I thought it'd be kind of fun to do a little spring fashion show for you and you guys I have a cute little girl that actually got a dress from her cousin today from Target as well so we thought we'd do a little spring fashion show for you so without further ado our special guest is Hi. Bella all right you guys we have our cute little niece Bella hey for guys <laughs> for anyone that's new to our channel, this is Bella May, and we actually live with them, which is so much fun. Tell us, didn't you get this dress just today? Yeah. Tell them how you got it. So my cousin came, um, 
here and they wanted to buy us something because you know the coronavirus and we wouldn't be able to go shopping so she just bought me the same dress that she has that is so cute so she brought you that dress uh-huh that's so cute so you guys i was telling bella i was going to show you guys my dress and she wanted to show you guys her cute new dress too so should we do a little fashion show uh-huh okay <laughs> And comment down below who did a better dance moves. <laughs> oh, <laughs> who do you think did a, a better dance moves? Do you think Maybe. Bella did or Aunt Britty? <laughs> <laughs> did you have fun though? That's the real question. Yeah. Yes. You guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us today. Make sure you subscribe if you aren't and give this video a what? Thumbs up. Thumbs up, guys. All right. We love you and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.